Are you gonna tell me where you went? All the messages I sent with no reply It's like that You're just gonna walk into my Hello my kings and queens, welcome to my channel Goddess of Whispers, it's your girl Karen and I am so excited to welcome my Pisces back to my channel. If you are a night watcher, welcome to our royal family. I do want to let you know this is a general love reading. This reading may or may not resonate with all of my kings and queens, so take what does and leave the rest. If this reading does not resonate, please check with your sun, moon, rising, and Venus placements. Also the energies or the roles in my readings may be interchangeable, so apply yourself as you see fit. Don't forget, if this reading does resonate, don't forget to click like, share, subscribe, and click the bell to get future notifications when your girl will be uploading another video. And as you know, my Pisces, your weekly does come with an extended. So in the extended, we dive deeper into the message. So what we don't uncover in the first half of the reading, we may uncover in the second half of the reading. There's two links in the description box below. One is a membership option and one is a one-time access option. Both options is $5. The difference between the two is the membership option will allow you access to all of my zodiac sign extended readings so you'll be able to check out all of your other placements and binge watch down there if you choose to all right my pisces let's dive in so prior to your reading guys i was definitely checking into the energies that is surrounding you this week and here are some of the things that i was hearing i was hearing all is fair in love and war is the energy and i was hearing i am not done with you yet <laughs> okay so i'm definitely seeing five of swords energy this kind of manipulative type of energy i'm also seeing um the devil kind of energy you know that kind of energy where you guys are feeling it's almost like some type of bondage okay between the two of you some type of codependency is the energy that i'm seeing here a back and forth kind of energy you know um this person definitely is in a headspace where it's almost like okay it's all right we're, we're done but guess what we'll be back we'll be back together again <laughs> i'm not worried you know that's my person we're gonna ride this out till the wheels fall off that kind of energy guys is what I am seeing here. So we're going to dive in, okay? We're going to see what this energy is in regards to, okay? And keep in mind, this will resonate with some of you, not all of you, okay? What is the energy here, Spirit? Clarify further. What is the energy here for my Pisces? What's the energy here? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, beautiful, beautiful. What are the energies is here? What are the energies is here? Clarify further. What are the energies is here? Thank you, thank you, thank you. What are the energies is showing up here? Thank you. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. What other energies is here? We need one more. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, one more, one more. What's the energy here, spirit? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And at the bottom of the deck, we have the wisdom card is the energy, okay? So very strong energy surrounding the collective. Let's see what we got. We got the accelerated motion. We got the partnership and alliance card. So that is the eight of wands and the three of wands. We got the power card, which is the energy here, which is the strength card. Could have been dealing with the Leo, with the wands energy. Could have been dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius. We also have the death card showing up here, the transformation card. So definitely strong energy. You could have been dealing with the Scorpio. We also have the six of swords here, the moving on card. And then we also have the patience and planning card, um, which is definitely an energy about, you know, waiting for something to happen or waiting for something to come back to you is the energy here or the fruits of your labor is now starting to come in could be the energy. So let's dive into these energies. Okay. But this eight of wands energy and the accelerated motion there's definitely something happening here on the horizon. I feel like someone's coming back to want to work things out with you is the energy that I'm seeing. Okay, so you could not be talking to this person or vice versa. Take it as it resonates. But this is definitely a strong energy of someone wanting to now come back in and express how they feel about you. For some reason, I'm getting an energy of, you know, this is it's, it's almost like a game. If that makes sense to you, you would know more than I do in the situation. But definitely seeing you know, you decided to move on from this person or this person decided to move on from you, but it's almost an energy as if, okay, we're done, but we're not done. Okay. We're going to have a second time around because we always come back together again, no matter where, how long apart we are, we always come back together. It's like, you're my person. That's the energy that I'm seeing. Okay. But someone here could definitely be in a space where they're over it. They're over the back and forth with this person. Someone here, I feel like is in a space where they're, they're, they're learning life lessons. They're learning. There's more to life than, you know, going back and forth in a situation that is not healthy for them. Okay. Especially with this wisdom 
wisdom card showing up at the bottom of the deck. For some of you, you could have been married to this person. Take it as it resonates. But this is definitely some, some type of epiphany or spiritual awakening. Fives represent change. So definitely seeing that here very strongly. Some type of change is the energy. But I'm definitely feeling, I'm seeing four of wands, I'm sorry, four of cups energy here. You know, that kind of energy where someone is feeling unfulfilled in a situation. You know, wanting their person back, you know, feeling boredom. It's almost like, like I said, some type of game. Seeing Five of Swords energy as well. That kind of game as well. We uh, Manipulation, I mean, as well. We do have the moving on card and then the, the transformation. So things have definitely ended between you and this person. This person has moved on is the energy or maybe you have moved on. But someone here is still waiting. Okay, they're patiently waiting for you to come back to them or vice versa. Take it as it resonates. This person feels like no matter what, we are always going to come together. We are always, all we need is that conversation. Once we we have that conversation it's a wrap yep we are coming back together again this person feels like no matter what you guys will always come together that strong like like it's almost an energy of also two guys like no matter what it takes i'm going to get you back when i'm ready to have you you know, that kind of energy here. So take it as it resonates. This is some of you, not all of you, but definitely seeing that. But I'm seeing someone here is trying to move on and move past this toxic situation, okay? Let's go ahead and get some more energies that is surrounding this reading, okay? What other energies is here, Spirit? Clarify further. Thank you so much, Mary, for this deck. This deck was donated to the channel. It's the Numerology Guidance Card deck by Michelle Buchanan. Thank you, Mary, for that. She actually accessed this from my Goddess of Whispers wishlist link, which is also in the description box below. So thank you guys for any support to the channel, all right, to give you guys more accurate messages. All right, what's the energy surrounding this reading spirit? What's the energy here? What's the energy here? Oh, that's way too much. We have self-love here, okay, showing up and showing out. So we'll take that one since it flipped. So definitely a strong energy someone here is trying to move forward okay someone here is trying to let go as hard as it is because we do have the strength card showing up here which is this energy someone is trying to find that inner willpower or that inner strength i'm hearing stand your ground okay someone is trying to stand their ground in the situation because they always take this person back okay that's the energy that i'm seeing so someone is trying to love themselves more and release this negativity this toxic situation let's get one more card What's the energy here? What's the energy here? What's the energy here, Spirit? What's the energy? One more card. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Healing, okay? Interesting energy. So someone definitely is in a space where they are healing from the situation. It's just becoming a lot for this person, whoever this is. This could be you or this could be them is the energy. But definitely with the self-love card and the healing card, a very strong energy. Someone is trying to take back their power and learn from the experience and move forward, especially with the wisdom card being here let's go ahead and tap into the energies a little bit deeper what's the energy here what's the energy here spirit what's the energy here clarify further what's the energy surrounding this reading what's the energy surrounding this reading for my pisces what is the energy here thank you thank you thank you what is the energy here a few more shuffles what's the energy surrounding this reading what's the energy here thank you thank you thank you let's see what this is we have the temperance card. Yes, yeah, something about this connection definitely was needing balance, okay? The temperance card is definitely an energy about, you know, balance, being restored to a situation, self-control. I'm feeling like this relationship was definitely one of those that was just like you know, a fast paced, meaning like everything around you was moving slow outside of the relationship, you know, um, on the outskirts of the relationship, but inside the relationship, you guys were moving super fast. That's the energy that I'm seeing. You know, it's definitely a space where I feel like things needed to be done in moderation when it comes to this connection. You know, I'm definitely seeing a lot of, you know, um, disagreements between you and them. Someone keep repeating the same mistakes over and over again is the energy, but I I definitely am seeing an energy of you know a toxicity okay if that if i may say so what other energies is here spirit what other energies is here let's see what this is we have the ace of wands i'm telling you guys this person wants a fresh start the temperance card is also a card that means re reconciliation ace of wands is an energy about coming together again this person is definitely coming in to offer you a new beginning this person wants to partner with you again is the energy okay so we have the high priestess showing up here that's felt 
fell, fell out under the power card definitely needing the strength okay something came out to light here is the energy and you walked away from the situation with the eight of cups i feel like this was just too much it was a lot of passion there was a lot of fire here in this connection i'm feeling very strongly here someone had to follow their intuition with the high priestess could have been dealing with a pisces or a cancer scorpio here take it as it resonates you know things were just too much for you you have to trust yourself here and move forward is the energy what was in the dark definitely came to light here and it was kind of like a repetitive cycle is the energy that i'm seeing between you and your person let's see what this is we have the hangman showing up and showing out so very strong energy about letting it go okay moving forward making that sacrifice to do what's best for you is the energy here but i also feel like with this energy this is about becoming enlightened in the situation you know coming to a, a realization that probably you need to let this situation go we do have the justice card showing up here so very strong energy that this relationship was needing balance okay balance needed to be restored in this connection clarify further what are the energies is here spirit thank you thank you thank you we have the two of wands showing up here as well this is very strong energy i'm telling you someone is waiting for you to come back okay or maybe you're waiting for them to come back but i feel like this is like an ongoing cycle between you and them is the energy this is definitely about making some type of decision or some type of choice and this had to do around with moving on in the situation someone definitely made a decision for the betterment of their future to move on from the connection okay look at that guys the seven of swords very toxic type of energy and look what we have at the bottom of the deck the strength card needing needing the strength to move forward from this person is the energy that i'm seeing the seven of swords definitely speaks of you know energies of betrayal um dishonesty running away from situations divorce it could even mean an affair here is the energy but i'm definitely seeing there someone is wanting a second go round let's see at the bottom of the deck didn't i say that five of swords energy and look what's here and then i mentioned the four of cups guys look at what's at the bottom of the deck the strength card the five of swords and the four of cups just like i called it okay very strong energy guys this is the energy of manipulation this is an energy of games going back and forth is the energy here someone needed the strength to move forward from this toxic energy is the energy that i'm seeing but i'm seeing that someone here is in this four cups energy missing their person wanting this person back into their life feeling like they're missing out on opportunities even though they have options you know they are still wanting you to be an option in their life is the energy okay this five of swords is definitely someone of, that that plays mind games okay someone is thriving off of that energy but someone the other party is needing the strength to move forward finally saying to themselves that i need to release this i need to heal from this situation i need to move on i need to focus on me this situation is becoming way too toxic for the both of us is the energy that i am sensing here okay i want to get one more few more cards here what's the energy here spirit okay the moon card here look at that guys definitely a strong energy this is about being in your heads about the situation this is about healing in darkness for some of you could be the energy here as well Try in your thoughts you could even be dreaming about the situation this is some of you not all of you okay is the energy that is surrounding you but i feel like this was a very tough decision for someone because this card also speaks of deception illusions things were not as it seemed in the connection between you and them someone is just tired you could have been dealing with the uh, pisces here with the moon card energy a leo with the strength card here showing up twice in the reading okay um water sign is here pisces cancer scorpio is showing up in the reading as well with the temperance card you could have been dealing with the Sagittarius um is the energy and with the hangman energy this is definitely an energy of water energy so Pisces Cancer Scorpio showing up here as well or air energy is showing up here as well so pretty much the whole gang is here guys but I like to let you guys know what signs are showing up in the reading but nonetheless guys I'm definitely seeing a, a, a really strong toxic energy but I feel like someone is now coming into a space where they're learning their lesson from the connection and wanting to move forward with their life okay is the energy surrounding this reading let's go ahead and clarify the temperance card the ace of wands 
Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. We have the Knight of Pentacles clarifying the Temperance card. So that is definitely some type of movement coming in here towards you. This person is wanting to come back. It's very slow movement, but definitely a movement of someone wanting to make a move towards the situation and the connection. Clarify the Ace of Wands spirit. Why is the Ace of Wands here? Thank you, thank you, thank you. We have the Ace of Wands clarifying the Ace of Wands. This person wants to come back in and offer you a new beginning in romance. Okay, this is about passion being reignited in the connection. Then we have the queen of swords energy showing up um, over the high priestess so very strong energy here guys i'm definitely feel like some type of secret came out but someone became cold as ice towards the situation okay that could be you that could be them take it as it resonates you could have been dealing with an air sign aquarius gemini libra so whatever secret it was that came out here someone decided that that they were going to turn their backs to the situation and cut you off or they cut you off take it as it resonates i feel like it was an energy of enough is enough okay clarify the hangman why is the hangman here thank you thank you thank you clarify the hangman spirit what's the energy here let's see what this card is we have the three of pentacles okay very strong energy this energy speaks of working things out in situations making the sacrifices the energy here behind this three of pentacles energy so this person things have ended between you and them but i feel like this person is in an energy where they're not done with you yet it's kind of an energy of you know i'm gonna just hang this up for now but i'll be back we will will be working this out that's the kind of energy that i'm seeing here at the bottom of the deck it's a two of swords that's definitely feeling like you're at a crossroads needing to make some type of decision when it comes to a situation okay this is about balancing out things in situation this is balancing two forces okay time to compromise time to make a decision this person's in and out of a decision is is this over or should i come back in and work things out with this person let's see what this is the eight of cups clarifying the moving on card and the two of wands very strong energy someone decided to move on from the situation this energy here definitely with eight of cups energy is someone that truly loves you someone that cares for you very very deeply is the energy but they had to do what was best for them it was very hard but they had to make that decision for the betterment of themselves the bottom of the deck what we have here the two of cups very strong energy this person does love you this person cares about you this person does want to be with you this person is in an energy where nothing nothing amounts to you no one amounts to you, okay? You are their person. They are feeling unfulfilled and they know in their minds, okay, that you and them will be together again is the energy, no matter how many times you guys say you're done. That's the energy that I'm seeing here. And look what's at the bottom of the deck, guys, the Knight of Swords right after that. Very impulsive type of energy is the energy here. Clarify the Seven of Swords. Why is the Seven of Swords here, Spirit? Clarify the Seven of Swords. Clarify the Seven of Swords. Why is the Seven of Swords energy here? Clarify the seven of swords thank you thank you thank you we have the page of cups okay is the energy here very strong energy page of cups speaks of love news coming in okay uh or new new love on the horizon take it as it resonates i do feel like no matter how long time goes by okay this person is definitely in a headspace, and this is clarifying the seven of swords, okay, manipulative type of energy. This person will always come back to you because they feel like they can always have you. That is the energy that is surrounding this reading. And at the bottom of the deck, we got the high priestess, and we got the page of cups, I'm sorry, the page of pentacles, and then we got the justice card. Very strong energy, guys. This is definitely about coming in to speak your truth or wanting to balance a situation out. This person's coming in with their small offer, but whenever they come in, this person may not be able to be trusted is the energy here especially with the high priestess here this is someone who has a lot of secrets this is a mystery person okay but nonetheless it's a game to this person is the energy surrounding this situation this person is very dishonest is what i am seeing here when it comes to you and them working things out okay all right guys you're going to want to meet me over in the extended we're going to dive deeper into this energies i want to know more about this person i also want to know what the outcome of the situation is going to be and what is it that they're not telling you in the shadows and also to what is truly holding your person back okay because we do have the knight of pentacles which is there are they are coming in towards you but it's slow moving energy okay so we're going to dive in and clarify these energies further thank you guys so much for joining me Till next time, bye. I guess you're back. Are you gonna tell me where you went? All the messages I sent with no reply.